Then we come up with, very recently, what happened in Venezuela. In 1998, Hugo Chavez gets elected president, following a long line of presidents who had been very corrupt and basically destroyed the economy of the country. And Chavez was elected amidst all that. Chavez stood up to the United States, and he's done it primarily demanding that Venezuelan oil be used to help the Venezuelan people. Well, we didn't like that in the United States. So in 2002, the coup was staged, which there's no question in my mind, in most other people's minds, that the CIA was behind that coup. The way that that coup was fomented was very reflective of what Kermit Roosevelt had done in Iran, of, of paying people to go out into the streets to riot, to protest, to say this Chavez is very unpopular. You know, you, if you can get a few thousand people to do that, you, 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 television can make it look like the whole country and things start to mushroom except in the case of Chavez he was smart enough and the people were so strongly behind him that they overcame it which was a phenomenal moment in the history of Latin America